Traffic just was top of mind. Will you be sure to get us uh, the contact at Wounded Warrior so we can put stuff together to get the word out? Absolutely, I'd be happy to. Can, can you just send me an email to remind me of that? What the date again, Phil? On November the 10th. The, the, the month of November is going to have a, an event every single weekend. The first weekend is going to be the Homestead Air Force Base Air Show, where you're certainly going to be all invited down. Free show. Come on down to the base and jump in a jet, take it for a flight. If you like it, write something good about it. The next weekend is going to be Rides and Smiles. Third weekend will be the uh, final NASCAR event. And the fourth, of course, is Thanksgiving, where we get to stay home instead of being at the racetrack. So, thank you all. Thank you. Thank you. I'll get out of your way. There is a, a bomb just exploded in Bogota. Three people died, and 18 was. There's a bunch of explosion in Bogota. Terrorist. Uh, okay. Uh, Marcelo, Marcelo Serrato is going to tell us some information about the troubles in Miami, which we have already the date and everything. Yeah, I've been working with Paul. We've been working very hard with Paul Boyd to try to make sure everything works in accordance to uh, the hotel, the risk of the state, that everything's going to work okay, and the dates to make sure most of uh, the manufacturers will be participating and they can play. So we have finalized the date, and it is going to be. June 14, which is a change from what I said last last month. The circumstances came up. June 14. So June, June 14. That's a Thursday. We need to make sure. Hopefully, most of you members will be able to participate. It will be a, a full day affair. Remember last year, in our inaugural day, it's a full day affair. We're going to start a little earlier. We're going to start. Uh, have you checking in at 8:30? 8.30, but please try to be prompt because if you remember last year, you guys were very busy, you worked very hard to try to get into all the different models so we can provide the, the information to Mr. Ron Beasley that will be spearheading the, yeah, the okay. award. Do we have information? We are, we're working with them, so we're, we might create... Uh, go ahead, Paul, you can take on that one. Well, I don't know, we were looking at, into adding another category uh, if you remember, our categories last year were luxury, family, sport, small, right? Yep. And then an overall winner. We're going to add, if we have three entries, and it looks, it looks pretty good for this, an ultra luxury uh, category also. So that's, there's more cards for you to try. So that's another reason why we're starting a little bit earlier. Yeah. So, so with that in mind, it's very important. I know you want to mention about them saving the date and showing up. Go ahead, Tony, if you want to finish. No, just make sure that since we have that change that you mark the date, save the date now, and when you get your content coordinated, then uh, Pepe, you can bring it to him, so not only do we get uh, extra viewers on your own uh, various sites and content uh, locations, but we also get that extra boost from Pepe and the SAMA website. So keep that in mind if you're blogging, tweeting, putting your video together that uh, Pepe Delfino will have that for you. We're gonna so save the date now. We're gonna have great participation for the manufacturers. They're gonna bring the products just for you guys. The cars will come specifically just for you guys. So it's really important that we give something in return for that investment for them and that we generate some buzz and actually put those vehicles in there. And then of course we do have a dinner. So we want you all to attend the dinner and I believe last year you were able to come with your better halves or whoever you want to bring. So uh, definitely that still will be open and we'd love for you guys to be. So it's gonna be a full day affair. We apologize. We are gonna decide uh, and we're gonna discuss about if we make that our monthly luncheon based that you guys are gonna take so much time. So we're gonna talk to some manufacturers. We're gonna have a, a meeting with the board and make a decision just as long as we have you guys for that Thursday that's gonna be so important for all of us. So very important. Any questions on that? Okay. I do have a couple of announcements I wanted yes, to make. Yes, please. Uh, we have uh, one of our members. We always like to congratulate when one of our members has, has done something wonderful. I know that Maria Ravani has won the award for the best Brazilian magazine in the U.S. Oh. 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 Very proud to have you. To have your board, if you want to speak a little bit on it, please. Yes, we won uh, two awards. One for the best um, original on the original cover on the interview, 
and the old one is a gold medal for the 10 years anniversary of the magazine. So that was from the Brazilian International Press Award. Yes, I would like to introduce Melissa Galarza. She's got news, kind of sad, kind of happy. She's going to tell us about it. Hi guys, so I know that I know um, some of you and some others are new faces, but um, I work with Stephanie Camargo, who um, this is what I make a quick announcement, is no longer working for General Motors. Um, she left our agency last week, but she got an awesome opportunity at MasterCard, so she sent her love to all of you guys. Um, and I just want to let you know that you can contact me if you need anything from General Motors, as well as my team members, Battery and, and GDS, who are sitting here with me. So just let us know if you need anything, I'll be happy to help you. Stephanie is a blogger we all know, and she is always welcome to join us anytime she wants. Anything else? Please, coverage. We need coverage for our events. If you have a friend, any kind of media besides automotive media, please let them know about our couples in Miami, our rides and smiles. We need as much coverage as we can get because that's what we promise our very good friends of the auto industry to provide them in return of their always welcome help. Run Beasley. Yeah, I Reiterate, I guess, that it's important that this topless in Miami event that we have a good showing. It's important that we get as many of our membership to turn out for this event as possible. As we did last year, I think we had 45 members that came. And it's equally important that once you come, that you drive every car there and you score it according to the, court, uh, to the scoring sheet as you did last year. Last year was tremendously successful. The manufacturers were extremely happy with the event, and I'm just hoping that. I can impress upon you all how important it is that you turn out and try to attend this event. I took a picture and I